Bill Wilson, you went to Canisius, uh, kind of a slow start in that game, but you got it rolling in the second half. Yeah, the guys did a good job over the course of 60 minutes, but uh, really stepped up and uh, hammered our opportunities on the offensive end in the second half. We went on a, a 9-2 to run. Uh, I think the bright spot on the day, again, Trent Harper at the faceoff dot. He's done a good job for us. And then Ryan Lynch also stepped up. I believe he was 6-9 and nine facing off in the second half for us. Uh, and then defensively, Brandon Jones continues to be our voice at that end of the field. And, and the the defense locked them down in the second half. Uh, I think a lot of that was attributed to our discipline. In the first half, we had a number of penalties, and uh, Canisius was able to um, keep uh, keep pace with us offensively by by scoring on their opportunities. Yeah. And a bright spot offensively, uh, August Johnson. August did a good job. He was four and two on the day. Um, our coaching staff made a decision to move him down to attack uh, before that game, and uh, he's just stepped up to the challenge, uh, and he. Uh, was pretty productive over the course of the game. Detroit Mercy in a weird uh, Wednesday morning game uh, because they're on their spring break is coming in here. Yeah, we're welcoming Detroit back to Colorado. We've been playing them for a number of years, home and home. And uh, they're a pretty talented group. They've come off of uh, a couple big wins against Marquette and Bellarmine. They're scoring uh, double-digit goals every game, and uh, it'll be a big challenge for our defense to step up. It'll be fun. We'll see you. Uh, good luck this week. Looking forward to it. Thank you.